Well, an uptown residence open since 1926 is still thriving despite the ups and downs of the pandemic. But it's facing a new set of challenges after serving customers for more than 90 years. Fox 46's Maureen Wirtz is live in uptown and Maureen Green's lunch is a staple here in the Queen City. Lindsay, it's a staple that's been open for generations. And like you guys just said, we've seen a handful of mom and pop restaurants close in the last few months. And folks here at Green's Lunch say it's tough staying open. It's easy to feel small when looking up at the buildings that tower over Green's Lunch or sit on the stools that have been here for decades. But being small isn't always a bad thing. It has a history behind it. Green's Lunch has been a family business for Joanna Zakiotis for decades. It started in 1926. My father finally said, enough is enough, and he tore it down and built this one. <laughs> but the new building was built in the late 70s before Uptown was the Uptown we now know. Growing up in Charlotte, it was, I would call it a hick town, you know? I mean, everybody knew everybody, you know? We never locked our doors. As the city changed around them, Green's Lunch stayed the same. Yes, I'm get uh, two hot dogs with ketchup. Serving the same hot dogs and the same fries for generations. I get the same thing pretty much. Always. Yes. <laughs> two hot dogs all the way. Two hot dogs. And chips and sweet tea. And while being a Charlotte staple has its perks. A lot of people ask me that question, oh, are you going to sell like everybody else? Joanna says it's not easy staying open, especially when she can't find enough people to do the work. You don't know what's going to happen, so... I kind of take it one day at a time, and I just thank God for keeping us well. This year marks the 95th year Green's Lunch has been around. Well, that's my goal, is to have our 100-year anniversary, but you never know. Every day is a different story, you know. You just don't know. She says their story may be a small one, but it's one worth telling. Yes, yeah, sir. Joanna says every five years they do a celebration here at Green's Lunch, but she decided not to do one this year and is hoping maybe by the time they turn 100, they can have a big event. Live in Uptown, Maureen Wirtz, Fox 46.